cardboard is a sustainable material where it could be recycled uh, after the exhibition and all the participants get to decorate the tiny little homes that's surrounding the Malayan sculptures. To make something that's standing at 3 meters tall, there's need a bit of engineering. There are different uh, activities for different age groups. Like my 8 years old, he will prefer looking at plants and my 5 year old will be more interested in some other STEM activities which involve art and craft. So I think I'll definitely bring them back next year or even year after. I'll definitely bring another younger kid along, the 3 years old, because since they're having a new toddler section. Well, it beats uh, staying at home and watching TV and um, being glued to uh, iPads and iPhones. So by coming here, it engages the kids. We live in a very technological type of society and giving them the opportunity to enrich their experiences will help prepare them for the future. After two years, we are actually going for our learning journey, so I thought Science Centre would be a great exposure for the children. On top of that, most of my children, they actually enjoyed learning about planets, the solar system and all that. So that's why I thought the STEAM Festival would be a great exposure for them. We are looking forward to what next year's theme is because this year my children actually enjoyed the different immersive zones and they also enjoyed the play. I'll definitely bring them back.